right so let's start off with my first tray of red lipsticks so um i do have a lip swatch of this one this is the juvia's place collaboration with fumi she is a youtuber here i have a review of the entire collection up on my channel which i will hopefully link um this is anastasia beverly hills american doll what it looks like it's a beautiful red color so that's american doll and then i've got carly sunset love the um shift of this one it's a beautiful pinky shift and then i've got chrome burgundy love this it's a metallic finish dark metallic finish the three that i just swatched are my abh lipsticks and then this one as well is abh and this is dazed don't think i've used this one but i do love the finish of that it's very very pretty and then i've got another one in current definitely haven't swatched this one a darker shade very nice and then the last ABH I have in this drawer is chrome red yeah this is the one that I I swatched this on my Instagram oh it's so beautiful guys honestly stunning okay and then my Gerard cosmetics in this drawer, I've got Metal Matte in Cherry Bomb. That's what it looks like. I have a lip swatch on the website. Definitely go check it out. I've got the I Heart Revolution Vanilla Cherry. This is the one that I said I have swatched. And I do love the formula of them. It's a glossy finish. Very, very pretty. Anyway, this is the um, Vanilla Liquid Lipstick in the halloween packaging and this one is in haunted i haven't opened this i am going to use it but i just haven't opened it and then i've got another vanilla cherry high heart revolution in cherry bomb what that one looks like nice glossy finish and then i've got the um kiss me by live glam who remembers this i had a subscription um with them and then i just had to cancel it because of everything that went on with bank accounts and yeah but i do love the formula of their lipsticks this one is dry enough but it's nice and i've got these two from colored rain i've got um this lip lacquer in cherry blossom it's very pretty And then I've got this one in Mistress. Oh, look at the packaging, guys. So pretty. Look at that. Look at the finish. Stunning. I've got this one from Fenty Beauty. This is the Uncensored. Love this. I've used this so much. At one time, this was my favorite go to red. We all know what a swatch is like. She's a beauty. And then I've got this Revolution lipstick, uh, Lip Euphoria in Fortune. It's like a gloss. It's like a purpley, purpley shade. I've got these two, the balms. This one is Devoted red not really too crazy about the formula but the colors are pretty and this one is sentimental it's more pinky so really should be in my pink draw okay and then i've got the superstay matte ink from maybelline and this one is in pioneer Beautiful red. I've got the Illamasqua Loaded Lip Polish in Vain. Use this uh, in a tutorial on my Instagram. It's just a beautiful red shade. It doesn't wow me, but I love the, the finish of it. 
And then I've got two lipsticks from Thin Lizzy. Haven't swatched these. These are lip creams. I've got Blushing Rose Candy Apple. And then I've got this one from Pixie Beauty. Haven't used it either. And this one is in Berry Beauty. I'll show you what it looks like, but that's what it looks like. Haven't used it, so. Right, so this is my second draw of reds. I'm going to go through this super, super fast as much as possible. So this is my Jeffree Star Rich Blood. I have a swatch of this on my channel. This one is Jeffree Star Designer Blood. also have a lip swatch. This one is Ho Ho Ho. This was from one of the Christmas collections. I have a swatch of this. This one is Checkmates. I can't remember if I swatched this one. So let me swatch it for you guys. It's a beautiful orange based red. And then this one is Wifey. Definitely didn't swatch this. This was from the Jeffree Star and Nate collection. It's a dark red shade. And then I've got a metal, a Hydra Matte liquid lipstick from Gerard Cosmetics in Groupie. I've got a uh, Red Brick Road. I love this color. I've got um, Immortal. Immortal is a beautiful red. Honestly, very beautiful red. I've got this Real B Cosmetics. Honestly, guys, I don't know why I still hang on to this. It's super old. Yeah, it's super old. I'm actually going to declutter it. Um, yeah, it needs to go. Real B is, a, is an indie brand, but it's old. I must have missed it. And then um, I've got these two Black Pop lipsticks. This one is in shade GNT06. Again, brands, you need to come up with names. It's all right. You know, it's okay. And then I've got this one in N286. Not the best formula, but it's all right. It's a beautiful red. Not the best, but it's okay. And then you've got this little smash box, guys. a metallic red. And this one is in shade Always On. Always On. And it's a metallic matte. Oh, I love the formula of this. So pretty. Beautiful metallic matte shade. I've got a uh, Revlon Kiss Cloud Blotted Lip Color. I either have a swatch on my channel or on my Instagram. And this one is in shade Cherries on a Cloud. Um, I've also got this E Unique Matte lip Lipstick. Definitely have this on my channel. Yeah, it's all right. And this one is in shade Virtue. Actually, it's quite old. Beginning to smell off. It's beginning to smell a little chemically. So we're gonna put that to the side. This one is also from E Unique and it's in shade the 90s. I've had these for a while, guys. Okay, this one still smells alright. I think I got this a little later. This one's smelling off. E Unique Beauty is an indie brand, it's a UK indie brand. Love the packaging of these, very different packaging. Formula is very, very nice. It will is long lasting, so yeah, definitely check them out if you guys are int interested. I do have a discount code you can use on e Unique Beauty for ten percent off. So I'm gonna declutter this one because the color smells a bit off. And then I've got these two lip colors from Sleek, and these are their Lip Shot formula. It's uh, more like a glossy liquid lipstick. This one is a brown, but I have nowhere else to put it. And this one is in shade Ready or Not. And then I've got this one in shade Behind Closed Doors. Literally don't have anywhere else to put these, guys. That's a beautiful color. Could probably go in my pink bar, so put that one. This is another Revlon Kiss Cloud Blotted Lip Color. This one is very soft. I've got this one from Me Cosmetics, and this is in shade Power. It's a matte lip cream. Oh, glides on like butter. Very pretty. I've got um, Stila. 
Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick in Beso. So like a mini size. Pretty red shade. And then I've got this NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in Monte Carlo. I remember when these lip creams were the craze and everyone wanted it. So pretty. And then I've got this Colourpop Ultra Satin Lip. It's a mini. And this one is in London Fog. This is like a pinky red shade. I've got the Jeffree Star Shane Dawson Collection. This one is in Are You Filming? It's a beautiful red shade. Beautiful blue base red. Gorgeous. I've got this one in... Oh, I've got another one in Besso. Probably I have swatched the two of them. So, yeah, we're going to just hang on to it. And these two... Actually, how many... These three, these four, <laughs> these four are from an indie brand called V Lace. Um, this one is Mrs. Lauren. I've actually got a lip swatch on my channel on my Instagram, but this is Miss Miss Lauren. That one. I've got Robin. It's a beautiful red. I've got Ego. Beautiful dark red. I've got Climax. Which is like a really light red shade. Pretty colors. Formula is very matte, so long wearing, it will stay put. And then I've got this Bella Pierre Kiss Proof um, Lip Cream in 40s red. Same as the blue, it's an, it's an okay, okay formula. And then I've got these two from MDM Flow. Again, they're a UK indie brand. And the shades that I've got is Supreme and 94. I think they are discontinuing their liquid lipstick range. I'm not sure. But I love the formula and I love the colors. It's pretty, that one. Stunning. And then the red is called Supreme. That's what it looks like. Gorgeous. You guys shouldn't sleep on indie brand makeup. Like, their stuff is super pigmented all the time. And then these are the last few of my ColourPop. I have swatched ColourPop liquid lipsticks on my channel for years. But I stopped buying them. I don't know. I just stopped. <laughs> so, this is what I've got left. I've decluttered the rest because they've expired. So, I've got Mamacita. If you want lip swatches of what they look like, check my playlist. Actually, maybe do check my playlist rather than me swatching them. And then you've got Cozy. You've got Notion. And then Lost. Um, Rooch. Um, Lax. And this one is Ultra Satin Lip in Darling. So, that's all the color pops. So, that's all my reds. Let's move on to purples. So, these are my purples. I've got, I've got Chrome Shadow from Anastasia Beverly Hills. I believe I have a swatch of this up. I've got um, this I Heart Revolution Vanilla Cherry in Black Forest. Beautiful color. Oof, yum. I've got this one from V Lace in Ho Me. Yeah, as in Ho. Use a Ho. Beautiful color. So I've got this one from Mud Beauty. Mud Beauty is another indie brand in the UK. I'm not really too crazy about their formula, but the colors are pretty. This one's called Blueberry Pie. I do like that color. It's a really, really cool tone. Purple shade. And then you've got Purple Rain. It's a gorgeous color. 
Then you've got this Gerard Cosmetics Ecstasy. You've got another one in Invasion, and these are the Hydra Matte formulas. You've got um, a metal matte in Grape Crush. Uh, another Hydra matte in Gravity. Another Hydra matte in Night Rider, and I have this twice because <laughs> I bought one before um, I started swatching for them. So I've got Night Rider twice. Um, I've got Wind Down, which I love. I've got Iced Mocha, nice cool tone, purple shade, this metallic matte in It's Complicated, another metallic matte in Underworld, and this in Sheer, this is a Hydra matte. Okay, and then I've got this Colourpop Satin Lipstick in Virginia. I don't know if I've got swatch of this one, so let's swatch for you guys. Or just colour. So I've got this Labelle um, UK Cosmetics um, Matte Liquid Lipstick. I love the colour range. And this one is called ne Neira Doll. You guys know I butcher name, so I am sorry. Love the packaging. Love the studded silver cap on it. Again, they're an indie, UK indie brand. Colour is very, very pretty. I did declutter a lot of the colors because they expired quite quickly so that's the only shade I've got left I've got this lime crime lipstick in fetish I do have a playlist of my lime crime liquid lipsticks but I'm not sure if fetish was in it so let me swatch that one it's a dark cool tone purple to be honest I've got a lot of that in Gerard cosmetics so yeah it won't be missed when it expires And then I've got this one from MUA Cosmetics, and this one is called Desire. Eh, it's alright. Next from Stila, I've got Viola. Very, very pretty, bright purple colour, like, eh. And then this one from Black Op in N2. Oh, I'm over it. I'm over it. If you don't have a name, go away. <laughs> the color's all right. And then this one from NYX is a soft lip cream. I believe this is Copenhagen. Yeah, Copenhagen. Remember when we all went crazy for this? Yep. Uh, another soft matte metallic lip cream from NYX in Seoul, C-S-E-O-U-L. It's alright. It's alright. I've got these three shades from Maybelline. This one, I love this one. It's a cool tone purple and it's a Superstay Matte Ink in Visionary. Oh, it's such a beautiful milky oh oh yum and then this one is called escapist again milky it's just yummy yum and then you've got creator love this one very pretty and you've got and then i've got this one from milani i believe this is the only milani lip product that i have <laughs> And I've had this for a long time. This one's called Sugar. And this is the Amora Matte Lip Cream. Still smells really nice. And it's still very pigmented. So keeping that one. It's the lip cream. And then also from E Unique Beauty, I've got this one in Vamp. Still smells really nice, this one. So it's a very black and purple shade. Love it. Don't actually think I've got any like it in my collection. And then from Beauty of Color, Beauty of Color is also an indie brand in the UK. So I've got Bold liquid lipstick, beautiful color. And then I've got 
Gra um, Gracious, also from Beauty of Color. It's a pretty color, isn't it? That one. And then I've got two liquid lipsticks from Colored Rain. This one is Berry Rain. Stunning. And also, what's this one? Roulette. Roulette is gorgeous. Beautiful color. You know I love color drain formula. And then I've got these um, color pop lipsticks in Guess. Have a swatch of that already. Hutch. Also have a swatch of that. Uh, marshmallow. Love marshmallow. It's such a pretty color. Um, tulips. This was my go-to. And then this one, Kapow. Yeah, I know Kapow. I do have a swatch of this, but this was my go-to back in the day. It's so dry, but I don't care. It's not spoiled. It doesn't smell off. So, oh, look at that. Stunning. So that is all the purples I have in this drawer. Next, let's move on to pink. Right, so for the pinks, um, let's just say that I hang on to them for work purposes because I hardly ever reach for my pink lipsticks. Let's just say that. So I've got these three from iHeart Revolution. These are the Vanille Cherry um, Liquid Lipsticks. In So these are the iHeart Revolution Vanille Cherries Liquid Lipstick. And this one is called Soup. This one's called Saw Cherry. It's all right. This one's called Wild Cherry. I was going to do a swatch video of these, but I never did. And then this one's called Cherry Cherry Aid. I don't know. Love it. That color is stunning. And then I've got um, R&B from Colourpop. I've also got um, Scrooge from Colourpop. I believe I swatched this as well. I've also got The Rabbit from Colourpop. I don't think I swatched this one. Pretty. It's all right. Then I've got this um, Live Glam Kiss Me liquid lipstick in Girlfriend. This is probably hella old, but it is a beautiful dark pink color. I don't really buy pink, so I try to hang on to the ones that I have. <laughs> and then this one is the ABH Pink Punch. That is pretty. I've got the Balm Sentimental. Okay, now, yeah, I showed you guys this, but did I swatch it? I don't think I swatched it from you, for you. So that's Sentimental. And we've talked about the sleek one. I've got um, Jeffree Star Diva. This was in the Jeffree Star and Nate collection. It's all right. Isn't his best, but it's all right. I've got um, Bella Pierre Orchid. This is more like a dark purple, but I haven't got space in my purple drawer, so we'll live here. MDM Flow Empire State. This is a beautiful color. That one. Um, v Lace Penelope. Like a neon pink. My Burberry uh, Magenta. Stunning color. Love the formula. La Belle UK in Candy Pink. Candy with a K. That is actually really pretty, that one. Ah. I've got the Vegas Ney and La Mia. I don't know. In Vintage Maroon. I don't think I've ever used this. Ooh, but that's pretty. I should use this. I've got Sleek 
lip shots and do what I want. It's a really light pink color. And I've got a couple of uh, Gerard Cosmetics pinks. So I've got Vintage Rose. I've got Metal Matte in Where's Ken. That's a fun color. I've got this um, neon color in Summer Loving. This one in Ballet Slipper. I've got this one in West Coast. This one in Coachella. That's another like a darker neon color. This is an, an everyday wearable one. 90210. I'll swatch this as an exception because I love this color. So that's 90210. I've got Honeymoon. I've got Jeffree Star and Shane collaboration in Jeffree What the Fool. Fill in the dots. Fill in the blank spaces. That is pretty. It's a pretty pink. Don't reach for it, but it's pretty. I've got Pixie Beauty and Petra Berry Beauty. Gorgeous color, isn't it? Very pretty. Illamasqua Shock. Yeah. That's a pretty pink shade, that one. Revlon um Ultra HD matte lip color in Addiction. I love the formula of these. They're very pretty. It's a pretty pink shade. I've got Sleek Laminate in Chaos. Pretty pretty shade. Great for mixing colors. It is pretty. Pretty inexpensive as well. I've got a cloud blotted lip color from Revlon in rosy cotton candy. I have swatches of this up on either my Instagram or on YouTube and that is like a peachy color. And then I've also got Stila in Lume or Lume, L-U-M-E. Let's pop that one here. That is pretty. Pretty, pretty dark, nice color. So that's all the pinks that I have in this drawer. So next we're moving to the drawers on this side. You guys can't see it in the frame, but it's got my glosses. And on top of that, I've got this little acrylic jar of glosses and they house my Jeffree Star the gloss. So these ones I picked up from the Bloodlust collection. I've got a lip swatch video up on my channel. I'm swatching these on my lips, so I'm just going to go through this real quick. I've got all of the shades. So I've got Iridescent Throne. I've got uh, Wizard's Glass. Love this one. The shift of this is stunning. And the packaging, guys. Like, the packaging is gorgeous, honestly. I've got Sorcery, which is a great everyday wear. I've got um, Sickening, which is great on top of purples and on top of blues. And I've got this one in Lord Star. I use this one quite a lot. And this is great on reds and dark purples and also on pinks. Also on top of this, I've got this new liquid lipstick that I picked up from Revolution Pro. This is the Hydra Matte Liquid Lipstick in De Luna. I've actually not even swatched this, like this is virgin. I've not swatched it on my hand, I've not swatched it at all, so wow. Wowzer. I knew it would be pretty, I just didn't think it would be this pretty, but that is that colour. I've got so glosses, I'm going to try my best not to swatch. Because, I mean, unless, I mean, it's a gloss. <laughs> I'll tell you the shifts, but again, it's a gloss. So I've got this, okay, this one's fun. This is a lip topper from Nip and & Fab. And this is in Galactic. Oh, God, guys, the shift of this one. Look at that. 
like a gold yellow shift and then these two I use them quite a lot in my videos this one has a purple um, it, like holographic finish to it and then this one has more like a rose gold finish to it and this is Jupiter and this is Neptune from Bella Pierre love them and then I've got who remembers these from Jouer <laughs> I've got these Jouer lip toppers um, and I've got I think I've got all the shades so I've got Saint Tropez I've got tan lines I've got skinny dip I love these guys like they smell like ice cream as well stunning and then I've got rose gold and then I've got skin I've got skinny dip twice literally you guys I'm awful yeah I've got two skinny dips apparently <laughs> oops and then I've got these um lip glosses from Ofra love Oprah love Ofra's lip gloss formula guys very pigmented very smooth beautiful on every liquid lipstick I own like literally very stunning so I've got Miss I've got BRB Oh, this is my favorite. This is Millie. This is a new one. It's a collaboration with a an influencer, content creator, YouTuber. This is the... I love this one. And then this one is a really, really pigmented gloss. I do have a lip swatch of this, I believe. And this is Supernova. And then I've got my um, Sarage P. Henson collaboration with MAC. And this one, did it have a shade? I d no, I don't think it had a shade. It's just from the collection. I did, I did do a sw lip swatch of this when I picked up the collection. So you'll see it in the playlist. But yeah, got this one. I've got Charlotte Tilbury Lip Gloss in Seduction. Oh, such a yummy formula very pretty works really well on pillow on uh, pillow talk and what was the name of the other one that i have yeah works really well on children so these three glosses came out during revolutions christmas collection last year i want to believe and i did lip swatches for them i'm so so proud of it i literally they asked me to do lip swatches of these and i almost gagged absolutely love working with revolution so these are their precious stone lip toppers i've got rose quartz i've got ice diamond that's a like really silver finish and then i've got what's this one ruby crush literally that it has a ruby finish you can check um revolution instagram swatches and then i've got these two glosses from mua academy this is part of their glow collection this is honeyed and this is aurora shine very pretty very inexpensive not sticky or icky the colors are stunning and yeah it's just very beautiful iridescent finish and then this recently came out from revolution uh, i stained mine i forgot to clean it i normally clean my gloss i normally clean my wands before dipping it back but that day i was rushing so i ruined it but it's okay i'll get another one <laughs> this is the revolution glass lip gloss so this came with the glass collection and then I've got this um, strobing lip gloss from Technique. And this one is in Flashy. Don't really use this. Um, not because there's anything wrong with it. I just don't reach for it. But it's got an iridescent purple tint to it, which is fine. I've got the shimmering lip sheen from Me Cosmetics. Love it. Beautiful everyday gloss on top of nudes. It's not going to show up much, so I'm not even going to try to swatch, but it looks really nice in nudes. I've also got this one from Miss Lean. This is Love at First, volumizing gloss in shades rubbed off, so I don't know. But this one. 18? Is that what's on the neck? I don't know. But, um, yeah, in this color. I've also got another one from me. Cosmetics, uh, it's a shimmering lip sheen. Again, looks brilliant on nude lip combos. Love it. It has like a rose gold finish. Clear gloss with 
some iridescent um, blues and purples in it from E Unique Beauty. I love this, guys. This is inexpensive and beautiful. It works like a dream. Can you see the finish? Stunning. This is XX Revolution coming out in June. And this one is in Strike. Again, has some iridescent sparkles to it. This is also from Technique. It's their strobing lip gloss in, in status. Has a red, copper red finish to it. It's all right. Love this one. It's a fully colored gloss from iHeart Revolution. This is the iHeart Chocolate Lip Gloss in, in Honeycomb. Gorgeous, very pigmented, guys. Like, oh, it's like butter. Butter. And then I've got this one from Technique as well. It's a metallic gloss in Bling. Again, I don't really have anything against it. I'm just not too wild about it. It's purple, it's nice, gloss. And then I've got this like a, it's like a lip oil, a lip balm from Revolution. And this is their Good Vibes Lip Balm in mood it's yeah it's a balm it's got a color to it but it's just a balm so i love the formula very nourishing on the lips especially when you wear lipsticks a lot you need to definitely take care of your lips and the way i like to split my lip glosses is high end and drugstore so let's go so my next layer is a little deeper so i really like this draw and i actually got it as a birthday present from my brother so Let's quickly go through these guys. So, drugstore side, I've got these pout bombs from Makeup Revolution. They're the plumping lip gloss bombs. This is actually one of my best viewed Makeup Revolution lip swatch videos. So, it'll be in the playlist. So, we're just going to run through the colors really quickly. I've got Glaze. I've got Juicy. I've got Candy. I've got sauce, little saucy. Oops. I've got peachy. These have like a little plumping effect to them. I really do love the formula. I love the shininess of it. It's not sticky or icky. The formula is just really, really nice. I've lo I lo um I've got cookie, and I've got kiss. Kiss is the last beautiful next also from revolution i've got these um revolution pro um i've got the revolution pro hydrating lip glosses and these have collagen and peptides in it um and they've got iridescence to it. like some of the colors definitely do have iridescence to it they're very pigmented they're very hydrating they really smell nice the wand is really nice love the packaging again i have a lip swatch video of these so this one is called suede i've got bitten bitten is a beautiful red oh i've got seduction I've got Midnight. Midnight is a beautiful, like, reddish plum, purple shade-ish color. <laughs> I've got uh, Played, pinky red color. And then I've got this one? Take a Stand, which is like an orangish red shade. And then these two are from Revlon and these are their plumping lip creams. And I've got this one in shade Velvet Mink. They actually do look like the tube. So this is Velvet Mink and this is uh Cashmere. And this is Cashmere Cream. They do have a slight plumping effect to them, but nothing over the like over the top or crazy or anything. So I've got those. I've also got this Lonely Old Incredible Glaze It Over Intense Color Lip Glaze in 
shade everyday selfie it's hydrating it's pretty but yeah that's about it <laughs> so i've got pixie beauty lip glosses some of them are in collaboration with influencers content creators so this is pixie x chloe morello in parfait i've got lip swatches of this on my instagram guys so yeah <laughs> Um, but they're beautiful. I use them on top of matte liquid lipsticks. I use them on their own. They're just gorgeous and very hydrating. And then you've got Cookie. Cookie has like a shift to it as well. This one isn't in collaboration. I don't think it's in collaboration with any influencer. I've got this one that is also in collaboration with Chloe Morello. And this one is Bon Bon. This is also in collaboration with Chloe Morello. And this is Sorbet. The shift of this is stunning. And then I've got this one is not in collaboration. This one is called Glace. I've actually, I don't think I swatched this actually. So that's like a rose gold finish. Super pretty. I've got these three um, Pillow Plump lip glosses um, from. Soap and Glory, and these are their Sexy Mother Pucker <laughs> Pillow Plump Lip Glosses. So you've got this one in Nude in Town. They do have a plumping effect, but it doesn't increase the size of your lips or make them full or anything. It just feels plumping. And then you've got this one in Claire. So this one is Clairvoyant. It's just a clear gloss. There's nothing, no color to it. And then you've got this one in Pinkwell. Literally looks exactly what like what you see. And I've got my lonely old Bobbery lip gloss in what's this one? Nutmeg. It's been used and abused. It's a beautiful neutral shade. Stunning. It's just a gloss, so it's not gonna show up much, but I do love the formula. Then I've got my Wonder Kiss Satin Lip Oil. I use this to hydrate my lips, especially if I'm wearing a very, very drying, like really drying liquid matte lipstick. And then I've got this one. I haven't used this or swatched this. This is the Glossy Lip Plumper from Pixie in Metal Ice. This is what it looks like. Just clear. I haven't used it, so I'm just going to keep it in the packaging just so that I remember that I haven't used it. That's all that's in this drawer. And then in this drawer, I've got my Revlon um, lipsticks. They've got different formulas in this one. I've got glosses and I've got matte colors in this. And then I've got my Gerard Cosmetics, um, the glosses, the smile, you know, the light ones. So I've got them in here. So I'm not going to swatch these. Check the website for swatches. So let's just go through quickly. You've got Plum Crazy. We've got Fiji. Literally what you see is what it is. Like, seriously. You've got Sugar Mama. You've got uh, Passion. You've got Palty Princess. I will swatch this one because it's got like a rose gold finish to it that I just love. Pinky base with a rose gold type of finish. You've got uh, Pink Tierra. This one's leaking a bit, so I need to stand that. You've got uh, Coral Craze. Um, nude. Um, cocoa bean. This is an OG cocoa bean. I love this color. I think I've got two backups of this because I love it. <laughs> um, seduction, beautiful, sexy, dark color. You've got uh, James. This is a collaboration with um, Lyrica Anderson. So, I love this color. Another collaboration with Lyrica Anderson is. Uh, navel. It's like a coral, orange coral color. 
This one is Salmon. This is Rose Hill. This is the um, collaboration with Jacqueline Hill, I believe. And another collaboration with Lyrica. This is Skin. This is Madison Avenue. And then this is Wild Orchid. So the next side, we'll go through this quite quickly. This is the Revlon Ultra HD Vanille Lip Polish. This one is in shade Natural. No, this one is in shade Act Natural. That's what it sort is like. It's like a coral peachy color. I love the formula of these guys. This one is in shade Birthday Suit. like a pinky nude shade this one is in shade berry blist stunning and they smell yum this one is in shade cherry on top gorgeous red very pigmented you see that and the shine on that stunning and then this one is Rule the World. Beautiful pink shade. And then my favorite is this nude one. And this one is called Date Night. It's gorgeous, gorgeous nude. Just pair with any brown lip pencil girl. Yes, pretty. And the other formula is, this one is the Ultra HD Matte Lip Color, Metallic Matte Lip Color. So you've got um, Shine. I believe I've swatched these, but I can't remember what platform it's on. But that's that one. Color Payoff is all right. Um, this one is in Gleam. All right, not crazy about it. So I think those are the only. I've got one more. This one is in glam. It's all right. So these ones are the matte formula. So you've got infatuation. So dark, dark color. This one is passion. Beautiful red. And then this one is in embrace. Smells yum as well. And then these ones are in the Hyper Matte Finish. You've got uh, 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 Saharan. Gorgeous. Um, it's like a warm orange color. Uh, desert Sand. Muted Purple Shade. Spice, one hundred, what? One hundred, okay. It's all right. It's a beautiful red. Oh, hope you guys can still see. Hope I'm still in the frame. And then, what is this one? Red Hot. It's all right. And the last one is in Death Valley. It's another muted purple shade. Right here. All right.
So this is my last lip gloss drawer. I bet someone's like, does she not wear nude lipsticks? But it's coming. <laughs> I do. <laughs> so this one, um, I recently used this in a video. So if you haven't, if it's not up, you'll see it anyway. So this is Summon, and this is from Revolution Pro. It's their Hydra Gloss. Spoiler alert, I love this color. Stunning, gorgeous, smells like butter. It's yummy. Let's check out the video. Um, I've got the Rev I've got the Revlon Kiss Glow Lip Oil in shade Bearing. In shade Beaming Brown. Doesn't really have much of a color to it. It's just like a a brown glow lip oil type of thing so it doesn't have much color and then i've got these glosses from revolution this was part of their christmas collection last year and this is called win it's gorgeous i've got i heart revolution chocolate lip gloss in chocolate brownie it's a yummy nude shade i've also got um Lip gloss in Ace from a Revolution. It's gorgeous neutral shade. And then I've got loads of lip vinyls from a Revolution. I am not gonna swatch them, just gonna show you guys because it's a lot. So I've got this one in bubble gum. This one in icon. Let me know in the comment box below if you guys want me to do a dedicated lip swatch video for these guys because I don't have one up so I can if I have enough people requesting it. So this one's called Icon. This one's called Cupcake. This one's called Gone Rogue. Love the brown shade, stunning. This one's called Ballerina. Black Forest. Glorified. Chauffeur. Thirsty. Ruby. Cherry, another ruby, <laughs> what am I like, dollhouse, should probably take one ruby out, it's cherry, it's ruby. another chauffeur, oh my gosh, Ballerina. Why do I think I've said that one? And Gone Rogue again. Why do I have doubles? <laughs> I need to go through this clearly. But So let's run through these quite quickly, guys. So Because there are lip swatches up on the Jara Cosmetics website if you're interested in any of these colors. So this is Pretty Penny. This is a collaboration with um, Lyrica Anderson in Naval. Yeah, Naval. Collaboration with Lyrica Anderson and Pretty Woman. Summer Sun. This is just GC. Candy Apple. Butterscotch. Pink Frosting. Um, raspberry Sorbet. Shimmer of Hope, Crystal, beautiful gold finish, Spring Fling, Candy Kiss, Vernio. I don't think they're, this is in circulation anymore, but definitely check their website. It's a black gloss. Oh, yum. 
Divalicious Eggplant. This is a white um, lip gloss in Phuket. <laughs> Phuket. <laughs> We've got a purple one in Bermuda. We've got a blue one in Bahama. And then we've got the lip glosses. Um, so this one is the Supreme Lip So now we've got the Supreme Lip Creams. This one is called Destiny. This one is called, I don't remember the name and the names of the packaging. Um, this one's called Man Eater. This one's called Wonderland. Wildberry Tart, Envy, Electric Rose, Blooming Hibiscus. And that is basically all of them. So this is the final draw. Let me check, <laughs> just in case. Right, so this is the final draw, and this is where I keep all my liquid, all my neutral liquid lipsticks. There's quite a lot. I do wear a lot of neutrals. And I'm keeping my dark browns in here. I'm keeping my neutrals. I'm keeping my golds, you know, that color family. And I have a few rogue lipsticks that have made their way somehow in here because I haven't got space in the designated area. So let's go through this as fast as I can because your girl's tired. All right. So, this is the Pixie Beauty and Mariam um, McCage, McLage, I don't know, collaboration in Posh Nude. I'll swatch some, but I can't swatch them all. So, it's like a cool tone neutral. I've got this one with from Coloured Rain in Empire. I love that colour. Stunning. ABH Chrome Bronze. I've got a lip swatch video of this one. ABH Bellini. I love this. It's got a rose gold finish to it. Great as a topper and just pop a lip gloss on top. Finish. Oh. And then I've got this one from ABH as well in Chrome Rose Gold. Haven't swatched these. These are new to my collection. So that's why I'm swatching it for you guys. Gorgeous color. I've got this one swatched already. And this is Chrome, Chrome Violet from ABH. All right. So I've got these two from Labelle UK. This one is in Pink Latte. This one is in Mocha. Love this color, stunning. And this is pink latte. I've got ABH um, stripped, beautiful color. I use this a lot. I've got um, Naked from ABH as well. Use these two. These two are beautiful with a lip pencil and a gloss on top. Um, Nip and Fab Matte Liquid Lipstick in Tarte. Exactly the same color you guys can see. I've got a few of my Gerard Cosmetics in here. This one is Metal Matte in Soho. I've got um, Hydra Matte in Aphrodite. I've got Hydra Matte in Skinny Dip. I've got Hydra Matte in Sedona. I've got Hydra Matte in Bear It All. I've got Hydra Matte in um, Salem. I've got Hydra Matte in Ruby Slippers. 
I've got Hydra Matte in Mudslide. I've got where are they? Hydra Matte in 1995. Love this color. I've got Hydra Matte in Dream Weaver. Um, Plum Crazy, Everything Nice, both Hydra Mattes. Um, Boss Lady, love this one. And also Serenity. Uh, Madison Avenue. This is metallic. So this is a metal mat in Fuzzy Navel. Metal mat in Double Shot. Uh, metal mat in Vegas. I love this. The beautiful gold metal mat shade. Metal mat in rose gold. And then my colored rain. I've got colored rain in bubble gum. I've got lip swatch of this on my Instagram, but I really love the formula. This is one of the newer formula, newer colors that they've got. This is in Nude. This is my favorite nude from Colored Rain. Literally, it's called Nude, but it's like my favorite go-to nude shade. Um, ABH Chrome Olive. Gorgeous. Oh, that. I need to swatch this. Actually, we'll put this up here so I can swatch. So nice. Um, Butterscotch is their newer color from Colored Rain. Look at that creaminess. Let me do that as well. Should I do that for YouTube? What do you guys think? Comment down below if you want me to swatch the late the latest colors from Color Drain for YouTube. I have individual videos on my Instagram, but let me know if you want it as a video on YouTube. I've got Color Drain Classy. It's a beautiful neutral shade. ABH Toast. This is a gorgeous neutral color. Beautiful for uh, melanin skin tone. Like, yes. Look at that. Gorgeous. I've got... What else have I got in here? I've got Too Faced Melted Matte... Melted me Metallic. Metallic. I don't know what they were trying to do. Play of words. And called Faking It. That's what they were trying to do. Fake it. It's a beautiful rose gold finish. I love it. Stunning. It's the only one I've got in this formula. I've got I Heart Revolution Vanilla Cherry in Cherry Bri Cherry Bakewell. I've got Kiss Me Live Glam in Naples. I did used to do lip swatches of my Live Glam bag. I've got Colourpop Beeper, Sigma New Mod. I love this colour. It's beautiful. And then I've got um, 9 to 5 from Colourpop. The name's completely rubbed off, but it's a, it's a rose gold finish. And I think it's a gloss, actually, if I remember clearly, but that's what it is. Juvia's Place Fumi Collaboration. I've used that quite a lot. Look at where it is. And um, this one is called Royalty. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Huda Beauty Girlfriend. I think this is the only liquid Huda Beauty product that I have. And I love that color. Stunning. MUA in Halicon. It's all right. It's all right formula, but the color is gorgeous. The formula is just all right. I Heart Revolution um, lip gloss in, uh, what is this one? Mocha. I'll actually put that up here. Uh, 
um, Hydra Mattes from Dura Cosmetics in Mile High. Stila um, Caramello. Love the color. Stunning neutral color. Paired with a lip pencil. Good to go. Um, uh, Jeffree Star Gemini. Jeffree Star Baby Daddy. I didn't swatch this one because this was from the Nick collection. But it's a cool tone nude shade. Love the color. And then Jeffree Star Mannequin. I've also got um, Chrysanthemum. And Rose Matter. I've got lip swatches of these up on my channel. I've got this one called Nathan. I haven't swatched this on my channel because this was again from the house collection beautiful star family house collection this one is the um collaboration with manu mua in called daddy it's gone like it smells awful but i'm keeping it because it was a collaboration and i stupidly sold the highlighter rather than keep it but yeah anyway that was inexperienced me then and then i've got leo i've got a swatch of this as well so this is one of the other newer um lip colors from color drain this one's called caramel it's so yum you guys let me know definitely if you want me to do a video because i can it's beautiful and then i've got this one from milani this is the amor matte lip cream in covet i actually thought i only had one but i guess i'm still hanging on to this brown it's beautiful and then what else i've got bella pierre in brown shell kiss me this was their holiday collection in venice this is Beauty of Color Cosmetics in Passionate. It's a dark brown color. Another Kiss Me Live Glam one in Madrid. Sleek Lip Shot in Brutal Honesty. Another Colored Rain Gloss. I love this one. This one's called Mars. This is a Wet n Wild. We've said we're decluttering these Wet n Wild ones that they're off, aren't they? So I'm going to take... Shall I? Is it off? Oh, yeah. It's off. So I'm not even going to bother. Um, I've got this P. Louise Hula um, lip gloss. This thing is yum. With a lip pencil. Gorgeous. And then I've got NYX Soft Matte Metallic in Dubai. I've got Revlon Kiss Cloud Blotted Lip Color in Whipped Hazelnut. I've got um, Stila Splendor the Shimmer Finish. Another Revlon Cloud Blot Lip Color in Chocolate Souffle. And then I've got an I Heart Revolution uh, Vanilla Cherry in... Morello. I love this color actually. Let's watch this one for you. It's a beautiful color. And then the rest, no, nope, I've got one more. And then I've got Colourpop in Frickin' Frack. Then the rest are Ofra. So this is my Flexi Stick. This is my Flexi Slick. This is a new one called Dash. This one, I've got lip swatches of these on my Instagram. Um, this is Sedona. Let me know if you guys want me to swatch these mini ones because I don't have um, any swatches of them. I've got Palo, Palo Alto. What? Um, Sunny Bell. Um, Unzipped. Portland. Aspen Valor, this is new as well. This is Story, this is in collaboration with Samantha March, and then Slip. 
is this a collaboration with Samantha? Yeah, I think so. And slip. Okay, so that's what we've got in this drawer. I know it's a lot. Let me know if there are any specific ones you want lip swatches for that I don't already have lip swatch videos and I can work on them. So, All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Sorry I couldn't swatch everything, but the video was just getting way too long. Let me know in the comment box if there are any lip colors you want me to swatch that I don't already have swatches for. Definitely check out my Instagram. I do a lot of swatches on there as well. And also check out the playlist in the description box below. So yeah, that should complete my um, collection videos. I don't want to do foundation or powders because I don't really buy that many foundations or powders. I like to go from um, foundation to foundation. I don't really like hoarding it. Um, let me know if there's any other collection video you guys might be interested in that I haven't done already. Um, I did say in my last haul video that at the end of the year I'm hoping to do a full declutter of my eyeshadow palettes, um, blushes, bronzers, you know, everything. Um, because I do know that I've got quite a bit. So let's see how much I get through this year. And then at the end of the year, I'll see if I need to do a declutter. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Subscribe um, if you haven't. Check out my other um, collection videos. I will link in the description box below. I've got eyeshadow collection, blush, bronzer collection, highlighter collection as well. Definitely check them out. Um, remember, God doesn't like ugly. Please be nice to someone today. And I will catch you guys in a future video. Thank you so, so much for sticking through. Bye.